you, Kev. Just got home today from work and uh, thinking about you and you. I almost felt bad for a second. What? Right. Truck wouldn't start, as usual. It's a common problem. I'm going to show you when this happens to you. When you get up there in mileage, I'm going to show you how to fix it. See, what happens is, is this thing has that... Um, this is called the Tipum. It's your fuse box. But instead of just putting a fucking relay, like a normal fucking car, they got to fucking stuff it way down on one of these circuit boards in here inside here so there's no fuel pump relay up here the fuel pump relay is a boat the size of one of them small blade fuses and what happens is, is once it goes bad you got to replace this whole module supposedly but just so you don't leave yourself stranded on the side of the road what you do is you take this you gotta carry some of these out of circuits with you i'd carry those with you or else you're gonna be fucking hoofing it this is a cigarette lighter fuse for the back. I think it's uh, M5 or some fucking thing. I don't know. So what I do is I just basically jump this out. This fuse over here. This one here. That is the fuel pump. So there's a little contraption I made to get me going here. Just to bypass it. And so what that does is that, because the relay, I'm not getting any power up here. When I go to put the key in the run position. So what this does is the cigarette lighter actually runs off the ignition circuit. So when I start it, it gets power to the fuel pump and the truck runs. This isn't ideal, you know, but it beats the fuck out of having a fucking... 5,000 pound fucking doorstop on the side of the road. So, so to let you know, welcome back to owning a Dodge. Enjoy.